What's up YouTube, and welcome to a Pokemon Crystal Nuzlocke by Mitchell of the MTP Crew. Now, for those of you wondering what a Nuzlocke is, and you may or may not be, a Nuzlocke is a sort of like a hard mode for Pokemon games, uh, where you have to nickname every Pokemon that you get. It's supposed to like build a special bond with everything you capture. Uh, if a Pokemon faints, you can no longer use it. It's dead. It's not KO'd, it's dead. It's fucking dead. Uh, what else? You can only catch the first Pokemon you see on every route. Unless it's something you've already caught before, in which case there's a, uh, a rule where you can, you can encounter that same Pokemon up to three times, and then on the third time, if it's the same one, you have to catch it, or, or leave it, or kill it. Um, but yeah, you get three tries to get a different Pokemon. Um, there are some optional rules to these things. Uh, one of the ones that I'll be following is using battle battle mode set. I, I think that's what it's called. Uh, basically, that means um, I can't switch Pokemon in a battle. I have, I mean, I can switch Pokemon in a battle, but I can't do it after I kill a trainer's Pokemon. Like I can't. Usually, there's a little box that says, "Oh, your opponent's using this. Would you like to switch out?" I can't, I can't switch out there. I have to stay in, and then I have to switch according to whatever they send in. So I have to, I'm going to change that in the options once we get into it. Uh, now, the reason I'm doing a Nuzlocke for Pokemon Crystal, uh, I mean, there are a couple. Uh, one of the, one of the, not bigger ones, but uh, Pokemon Crystal introduced being able to play as a female character, and I, I guess just maybe I've always picked the guy character. I don't know what it is, but. I've never played as a girl character in a Pokemon game. Not that it's a really big deal, but I thought I'd switch it up here and go with that. Go with being a girl character. Um, also, second gen is my favorite. Second gen encompassing gold, silver, and crystal. And so I wanted to do a, um, a Nuzlocke of one of those games. But I had never played crystal. I'd only played gold and silver when I was a kid. So we're going with crystal because I've never played it. So it's going to be similar, but there's going to be stuff I've never seen before. So... With all that out of the way, this cutscene is already played once, and I'm sure you guys have been kind of bored just watching it. I find it kind of interesting since I've never seen it before, but, um, yeah, let's go. Let's go right into it. Uh, okay. Alright, new game. My boy or my girl? We're going with girl. Boom. da 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 hmm, what? Will you check the clock for me? What time is it? Right now I'm getting a 2.45, so we're going to go two day, yes. How many minutes? 45, 45, whoa, 45 minutes, yes. Day 2.45, yikes, I overslept. Alright, we got our man Professor Oak over here. Hello, sorry to keep you waiting. Right, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Prof. Professor. <laughs> Uh, this world is inhabited by creatures that we call Pokemon. We got a smiling little whooper over there. Uh, people and Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them. Oh, some battle with them. Okay. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every single day. Now, what did you say your name was? Uh, okay, we got Chris, Amanda, Wana. What? And Jody. Um, mm, I don't like any of those, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to name myself after the game. We're going to go with Crystal. That sounds pretty good. Pretty fitting. Trainer Red. I'm going to be Trainer Crystal. Uh, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face fun times and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. I'll be seeing you later. Whoa, that's weird, Professor Oak. Okay. Alright, we're in our room. Let's look around here. We got bed. Be bed. Okay. Computer. Crystal. Turned on the PC. Mailbox. Get okay, email. Decoration. Put away our bed. Put away the bed. Oh man, stuck inside of our computer. That's that's interesting. Okay. Uh, uh, 
feathery bed. Let's put it back. Um, radio. Pokemon Talk. Pokemon Channel. This is DJ Mary, your co-host. Pokemon. Pokemon Channel. Well, that was very, very disinteresting. Uh, it's TV. Well, that's pretty disinteresting, too. A whole collection of Pokemon picture books. Okay. Town map. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Town map. There it is. Okay. Downstairs we go. Uh, I'm gonna guess this is our mom. Oh, Crystal, our neighbor Professor Elm was looking for you. He said he wanted you to do something for him. Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear is back from the repair shop. Here you go. Chris, received the Poke Gear. I think this is like our Pokedex? I don't remember. Pokemon Gear or just Poke Gear? It's essential if you want to be a good trainer. Oh, the day of the week is set. Isn't set. You mustn't forget that. What day is it? Today is Thursday. Yeah. Yeah, today is Thursday. <laughs> is it daylight savings time? I don't think so. Okay. By the way, do you know how to use the phone? Yes. Don't you just turn the Poke Gear on and select the phone? Well, why did you tell me if I already told you I knew, Mom? <sighs> yeah, it is pretty convenient, except for the fact that you had to tell me that. That wasn't too convenient. Hello, Crystal, I'm visiting. Crystal, have you heard? My daughter is adamant about becoming Professor Elm's assistant. She really loves Pokemon. That's pretty cool. Alright, so we gotta go see Professor Elm. Let's go check. Let's go check it. Let's go check. Hey! So this is the famous Elm Pokemon Lab. What are you staring at? Well, I'm staring at Ronald McDonald, motherfucker. Hey, that wasn't nice. Screw you, Ronald McDonald. Okay. Elm, Crystal, there you are. I needed to ask you a favor. I'm conducting new Pokemon research right now. I was wondering if you could help me with it, Crystal. You see, I'm writing a paper that I want to present at a conference, but there are some things I don't quite understand yet. So. I'd like you to raise a Pokemon that I recently caught. Well, you mean that one Pokemon that's right there? This one, right here on the right side? There's like one. Yeah, sure, I'll do- Oh, now there's three. Okay, very swift, Professor Elm. Thanks, Crystal. You're a great help. When I announce my findings, I'm sure we'll delve a bit deeper into the many mysteries of Pokemon. You can count on it. Alright, Naruto. Oh, hey, I got an email. Well, that's pretty cool. Hmm, uh-huh, okay. Hey, listen. I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him, saying that this time it's real. It is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Wait! I know. Crystal, can you go in our place? What do you mean, our... Professor Elm, you're, you're being really shady here. You're talking about people called Mr. Pokemon. That sound like those kind of people who go after Bigfoot. But it's really just like a stick in the woods, it's not really Bigfoot. They see like a, a dog paw print and they're like, oh, it's Bigfoot. Uh, Pokemon contained in these balls. Wait, what? that's not... Okay. Uh, y you'll be you'll be the Pokemon's first partner, Crystal. Go on, pick... Well, I would hope I'm the Pokemon's first partner. I wouldn't want to like take somebody's like beaten dead Pokemon. Alright, what do we got on the left over here? Cyndaquil. You'll take Cyndaquil, the fire Pokemon? No! I don't like choosing fire Pokemon as my starter. It's kind of weird, but I don't. Uh, Totodile. Do you want Totodile, the water Pokemon? No, I usually pick Totodile. I want to switch it up this time. So I guess that means we're going with... So, you like Chikorita, the grass Pokemon? <laughs> I sure as hell do. I think that's a great Pokemon, too. I bet you would say that no matter what I picked. You're so desperate for me to go on this mission. Give a nickname to the Chikorita you received? Yes. Okay, um... Oh, what do I want to name you? Let's see, you evolve into Meganium. Uh... Okay, so in uh, in Link's Awakening, one of the Legend of Zelda games, there's a hibiscus flower, and it kind of looks like Meganium's neck, and I was I was thinking about this because I was thinking about the starter I wanted to use before I even started playing. So I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go with that. I think I'm gonna go with Hibiscus. Um, ba -da 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 -ba -da 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 -da
this. Yes. Okay. I think that's how you spell it. I have no idea. Mr. Pokemon lives a little bit beyond Cherry Grove, the next city over. <clears throat> it's almost a direct route there, so you can't miss it. But just in case, here's my phone number. Call me if anything comes up. I'm not gonna call you. Pedophile. Goddamn. Alright, Crystal got Elm's phone number. If your Pokemon is hurt, you can heal it with this machine. Feel free to use it anytime. Well, thanks, buddy. Crystal, I'm counting on you. I know you are. Now, what do you want? Crystal, I want you to have this for your errand. Crystal received potion. Crystal put potion in the item pocket? There are only two of us, so we're always busy. That's that's pretty true. Must be pretty lonely here. Uh, well, there's Ronald McDonald still looking all creepy. Alright, let's get on with it. Let's go. Ooh, that's new. That did not happen in Gold and Silver. It didn't tell you when he switched routes. Well, like that, anyway. Uh, okay, this guy's like, Pokemon are scary. Popping out. Popping off, popping out. Um, oh, what do you have to say? Yo, how are your Pokemon? I thought he asked how many are you. Uh, if they're weak and not ready for battle, keep out of the grass. Okay. Sounds great. Sounds fantastic. Thank you, sir. Okay, nothing over there, so I'm assuming we have to go up here. I don't want to fall down there. Oh boy, first wild Pokemon battle. Oh, no, okay. So, th the rule is that um, you can't... Y I, I explained this before. You can not You can only catch the first Pokemon you encounter on every single route. Uh, but considering I don't even have Pokeballs yet, it's kind of unfair, because I think that means the first couple routes I can't even catch anything. So, I'm going to ignore that rule until I get Pokeballs. That sounds fair. I think that's fair. Okay, come on. I don't want to die right now. That would be not fair. That would be very unfair. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. I don't think you will anyway. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I was holding a berry? That's pretty cool. Okay, you're dead. You're fucking dead. Got some nice EXP. Um, Pokeball, another potion, that's pretty good, those will come in handy at this beginning part here. Ah, another Pokemon, what do we got now, another Pidgey, I like these little animations, I didn't know they made the animations like this in this game. There's a lot of this is, a lot of this is in there. Ah, uh, Pidgey you're weak as hell. Prepare to die? Come on. There we go. There we go. Okay. 15 EXP. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, oh. Another wild po I feel like this is gonna get real dumb real quick. Oh, we gotta center it. <laughs> Doing some kind of musical number over there. Um. All right, tackle tack. I did a good, good little bit. Okay. Mm Another tackle tack. This is gonna be like tackle express for a while, because I don't think there are many things to get other moves. Biscuit screw to level six. Not bad. All right. What do you have to say? I wanted to take a break, so I saved to record my progress. Well, that's pretty smart. Uh, uh, what do you have to say? Different kinds of Pokemon appear past here. If you want to catch them all, you have to look everywhere. Okay. You can't climb ledges, but you can jump down from them to take a shortcut. Well, thank you, sir. Route 46. See what's around here. I'm pretty sure this is a dead end. So we're gonna take a look at what's over here and then just get out. Okay. Uh, now I don't want to fight this Spearow. Oh wait, maybe it's all right. It's level two. I know Spearow gets pecked like really early on, and since we're a grass type, that's like you know no good. It's got growl. Okay, that's not too bad. <clears throat> Tackle attack. 
Oh, critical hit. Not bad. Not bad at all. Hibiscus, I think you and I are going to get along just fine. Okay, so there was a Spiro there. Let's just keep going. 29. Um, what's over here? More grass. Some kind of shady looking dude. There's a lady down there. Another Sentret. I think I'm just going to skip this one. Oh, no, that's level 2. That's fine. I don't want to keep getting into fights. I'd rather just run away. I mean, obviously I need to train up so I don't die, but... <clears throat> I don't... I also don't want to, like, do every encounter that I see. And just get super buffed up before I'm able to catch any Pokemon. Okay. I think, I think I'll go one more level and then I'll call it good. I'll just run after that. Alright, what do you have to say, lady? See those ledges? It's scary to jump off them. But you can go to Newbark without walking through the grass. Well, that's pretty convenient. I'll help out on my way back. Um, okay, what do you have to say? I'm waiting for Pokemon that appear only at night. That's true. They did include in this generation, um... Oh, hey, a berry tree. Doesn't look like a tree at all, but okay. Uh, they did include in this generation, like, day-night cycle. And then at, like, night, different things come out. It's, it's interesting. Is there anything... Oh, God damn it! Of course, first patch of grass. Uh, what do we got? Centre it again. Uh, mm, let's run. I kind of want to go heal the Pokemon Center first. Cherry Grove City. What do you have to say, old man? You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. Oh, this is looking really weird. Um. If you'd like, I can teach you if you... Th um... Yes? This is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. Please don't rate me. Please don't rate me. This is a Pokemon Mart. Where do you buy things? Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their prized Pokemon there. Please don't rate me. Not on the beach, no. Okay. Here, it's my house. Thanks for your come. Oh, let me give you a small gift. Wow, that sounded super shady, man. Okay, map card. Now the Poke Gear has a map. All right, yeah, you better go inside. I'm not following you in there. All right. Pokemon Center. Hello, welcome to our Pokemon Center. We can heal your Pokemon to perfect health. Shall we heal your Pokemon? Yes, please. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. I hope to see you again. It's great. I can store any number of Pokemon and it's all free. Yeah, that's pretty great. The communication center upstairs was just built. But they're still finishing it up. Well, okay. Ah, uh, and you, blue-haired man, with blue hair mustache. That PC is free for any trainer to use. Okay. Ah, uh, skip the poke. Wait, can I buy Pokeballs right now? Welcome, how many- Oh, I can! Oh, but there- No, I can't. Never mind. <sighs> of course. Alright. It's fine, though. Keep on pushing. What do we got? Please be something other than a Pidgey or a Sentret. Well, it's a Pidgey, so it's not different. Okay. Chikita Rita. Let's finish this off. Like, oh my goodness. What's this going to take? Four, five hits? If I connect all of them? Yeah, see? Attack missed. This is another reason why I don't want to do this all day. I'd rather just, like... Do a training montage, skip through the entire thing with super speed. Because I have, uh, you know, I'm, I'm playing this on uh, Pokemon Stadium 2, uh, so I can do super speed. Definitely not on an emulator. I've just got my capture card hooked up to my Nintendo 64. Okay, really, Chikorita? Come on, man. <sighs> okay. Another level.
Nothing? Okay. I thought for sure I was gonna get a move, but we kinda need to heal now, cause that did over half our health. I don't wanna, like, I, I know I have potions, but I don't wanna be out of potions before we are even getting into it, like. Alright. Yeah, you can see my Pokemon again. Thank you for waiting, your Pokemon are fully healed, I know, we hope to see you again, I know. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's keep pushing. Uh... Oh my goodness. No, we're just running. We're not even gonna fight you. I don't even... A Caterpie? Whoa. That's pretty cool. Uh, but we're gonna run. I just want to get to the next part. What's up here? You know, Pokemon eat berries. Well, my Pokemon got healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. Oh, thanks. Thanks, pal. And I bet there's another berry in that tree over there. So we're going to... Hey, it's Barry. <laughs> How's it going, Barry? Alright, up this way. Ah! Encounter rate? Why are you so high? Okay, another Caterpie. Ugh, gotta shift around. My legs are falling asleep. All these Pokemon being encountered. Gotta sit here for a long period of time. What's this? An antidote. That could be useful. Although I don't think there's a forest at the beginning. I think it's just this kind of grass area. Uh, Mr. Pokemon's house? It's a bit farther ahead. Uh, alright. Like this way? Go Rattata. Tackle. What? This is a big battle. Leave me alone. Yeah, it looks like your Rattata is getting fucked up. Um, so, up this way? Yeah, yes, I'm thinking. Oh, yeah, wait. It's Brookmont's house. Pretty sweet. Uh, it's a fruit bearing tree. It's a PSN cure berry. It cures you from PlayStation Network. Okay, also I want to, uh, pack. Um... What? That's not what I want. This one, give. Yes. Give this to Hibiscus. And then also, I have to do that thing with the thing. Well, let's, let's make text fast. Battle scene on. Battle style set. Sound stereo. Print. Menu account. What the hell? Okay. Alright. Hello, hello. You must be Crystal. Professor Elm said that you would visit. You look shady. Uh, this is what I want Professor Elm to examine. Crystal received mystery egg. Okay, put it in the key pocket. I know a couple who run... I know a couple... This is, this is wrong, because I'm sure it's... Uh, who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. Uh, I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon Evolution, Professor Elm is the authority. Even even Professor Oak here recognizes that. Oh boy. It's Professor Oak. Aha, so you're Crystal. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. He sounds like a villain. I waited here for you to come. Uh, oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon? Let's see. Hmm, I see. Well, okay. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this era. To researchers like Professor Elm and I, Pokemon are our friends. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah! You seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of Pokédex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Crystal receive Pokedex. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Crystal, I'm counting on you. Ugh. <sighs> okay. You're returning Professor Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. Oh, thank you. I'm depending on you. Alright. Uh-oh. Professor Elm needs something. Hello, Crystal? It's a disaster! 
Um, um, it's just terrible. What should I do? It- Oh no, please get back here now- Okay, you're relying on like a ten-year-old kid to help you out of this jam, whatever it is. You gotta be kidding me, man. Alright, let's go. Ah! Are the Caterpie- Let's- let's fight one of these. The Caterpies seem like they want to fight. I've only encountered like, what, three in a row now? String shot failed. That's interesting. I didn't know string shot could- I did- yeah. Yeah. Can't talk. I didn't know string shot could fail. And while that tackle did nothing, I bet I'm gonna get like, zero EXP for this. Gotta use tackle. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, look at all that health. Oh wait, that's not health, that's EXP. God damn it. Uh, is there like a shortcut down? Yeah, there we go. I'm liking that. I'm liking this one too. Let's keep going, let's keep on pushing. Back in Cherry Grove, all the way back to New Bark Town we go. All the way back. Oh, what the hell? Roland McDonald? You got a Pokemon at the lab. What a ways to wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Oh boy. Oh boy. Question mark, question mark, question mark wants to battle. We all know it's Ronald McDonald. Send out Cyndaquil. Go, Hibiscus. Alright. Alright. Cyndaquil's trying to burn all that good kush. Uh, we're gonna go tackle. Oh boy, shooting laser beams. Okay. Tackle attack, go. Oh lord. Oh lord. Another leer. I'm- okay. You wanna play that game? We're just gonna growl. We're just gonna keep growling. I don't know why you're faster than me. Why are you so much faster, dude? Okay, another growl. Now, now it's like neutral, because he's got two leaders off of me, but I have two growls off on him. How is- how are you still doing the same amount of damage? I just growled you. Okay. Keep it pushing. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, one more hit, I think. There's Barry. Alright, finish him off. Finish him off. Go, go, go. Oh my god. Oh, all that XP. And we learn Razor Leaf. Ronald McDonald was defeated. Hmm, are you happy you won? Crystal got $300 for winning. Not bad. My name is Ronald McDonald. <laughs> I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. And then he runs. America runs on McDonald's. Or Duncan. Or Ronald McDonald. Okay. I think that'll do it for the first episode. I think it's been like half an hour now. So, uh, next time we're gonna go to Professor Elm's lab. And we'll see what he wants. Alright, gonna save, and then we are out.